Hello and welcome back to No Man's Sky, everybody. Alan Paul here. We're going to do another speed run of the Singularity and Expedition, that is. And uh, yeah, voice is a little rough this morning. Uh, air quality index is terrible right now. I uh, want to thank Canada for that. Obviously not their fault. There's only so much you can do. I've been in situations where you've had lots of fires and stuff like that. And it's just nothing you can do about it. You do the best you can. Uh, so hopefully it'll clear up a little later on today. So get loose, used to a little bit of a rougher voice today. Um, pretty much that's the only thing that's affecting me. I've been going over the speed run quite a bit, watching Jason, watching a uh, little bit of Beeble Bum. I've watched Delta One do his. I honestly can't figure out how this guy is getting a, getting speed runs down around 50 minutes or below. It's incredible watching what he does. It all does depend upon your starting point there are three different starting points you can start at um, one of them is by a is very close to your ship uh, in a small encampment by the water where everything is literally right there for you and you can get everything within a few minutes one thing i try to do is i try to get atlanta dm and uh, other things early uh, if i can i've also found that at the trade station the first one you go to when you get into space and 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 drive over to your first um what do they call that uh, archive um that some of the pilots that land there you've learned or saw that some of them have gamma root on them and i had one run where i ran into four pilots in a row that carried gamma root and i was able to acquire over 600 gamma root just hanging around this space station uh, pardon me the archive so i'm beginning to wonder whether that might not be a better way to go if you can get that fortunate with the rolls per se, you know, because it's just a roll of the dice as to whether anybody's going to have that on them or not. Um, so that was a good run. I think that's what ended up at my one hour and three minute run. So 63 minutes. Um, I haven't been able to get below an hour. I've tried so many times. It's incredible. And I'm trying to figure out what I'm doing wrong other than I get a little bit of sidetracked. So I've got notes. I've got things that I need. I know what I need to do here. It's just a matter of getting it done properly. Um, so I'm hoping to get this going. Let's get it moving right along right now. And we'll get started. You see, we got a timer on the screen to keep track of things. So, and I start my timer. I don't start it when I appear on the planet. I start as soon as I get past the E on the screen and I start my timer immediately. So yeah, it adds another 49 seconds, but it's no big deal. It's just there for reference anyway. So I'm going to keep the mic open and get this done. If I am able to do a couple more speed runs between now and the weekend, it'll probably be without audio from my microphone, that is. Um, so if I do one at a really great time, you're probably not going to hear me talking at all. Um, as in that I'm doing it usually later in the evening and, you know, everybody's around watching TV, things like that. And there's a lot of background noise, so I try to keep the mic off during those runs. So uh, we should be popping in any second here. And enough of my babble. So I'll talk as we go. You're probably going to hear disappointment in my voice every now and then. But let's see what kind of spot we're going to end up with. Um, if it's the one on the steep slope, that would be okay. If it's the one that is just has it, uh, the, the ship at a further point over the hills, I'm probably going to restart. Just so you know. Okay. Let's get this going. Commencing All right. What do we got? Well, I can't tell by this yet. The mountains. Yeah, see the star the star bulbs over there are usually a hint. Another thing I do that a lot of the guys don't do is they don't scan the animals. There's only five of them here and you can get to them real quick. You can usually scan all five within a couple moments. And that gives you 1200 nanites to start with, which you don't have to wait on getting the rewards to get upgrades for your ship. So, this is not the one I'm looking for. I think this is the steep mountain. We'll have to take a quick look here, whether we like it or not. If it's the one over the hill, then we're going to have to restart. Let's see what happens here. Okay. All right. Ship down there. So this is the steep hill. So that's our ship. Okay. Let's uh, get out of here. All right. I'm going to pick up stuff. I'm going to, oh boy, already starting this morning with uh, figuring out how my buttons on my keyboard work. It's, it's early. Mm 
So if you're wondering what I'm doing here, I'm carving some stuff away because just in case I need my terrain manipulator, I need to be able to recharge it. Let's get to my multi-tool. We're going to uninstall it. We're going to go back here and uninstall these to get the items out of it. Uh, let's go over here. We're going to get the new multi-tool. All right, go in there. We have two. Okay, good. Uh, one, six, and twelve. And it always changes, unfortunately. So this one we can't write down. One, six. I can click it. Twelve. Deactivate. Deactivated. Let's get our new multi-tool. This allows us to pair and exchange. And then what I do is we got a supercharged slot over here, but we're going to get rid of the bolt caster. I'm going to put the shield down there. I'll put you over here for now. Okay, and I'm going to install our mining beam because it actually helps significantly in what we need to get done. Let's get over here and get this done, taken care of. If I can get it to activate, there we go. Do the same thing here. I didn't need to do that. Uh, but I'll go ahead and do it anyway. So that's what? That's uh, 11, 1, and 7. And this one changes too. It's the only ones that change. Okay, we got it. That should get that. Just go ahead and collect it real quick. All right, our ship, let's get that ship again. It is down below. I want to go ahead and mark it because I constantly ruined that. All right, we're on the hijacked laser. Oh crap. I can stop for just a moment and allow my jetpack to charge up. <clears throat> I'm trying. It is a very, very steep slope. Let's get over here. There we go. And we need some rocks. These big rocks actually contain quite a bit. I do want to scan them. They have a secondary element in them, which is dihydrogen, and that's handy. I'm always a little short on dihydrogen by the end of my runs. And get our Atlanta DM. You notice it's already about getting close to the five minute mark. And this is pretty much what happens to me every time. So if we had the lakeside one that we got a few times, then we'd be in better shape. Now we do want to get carbon, obviously. We got plenty of carbon in this guy right now. And there's some oxygen. Wow, we got all three pods out of that one. That's awesome. We want to scan these guys because they have oxygen. And they give us our carbon as well. And I need a good amount of carbon. I need more dihydrogen. I'm always forgetting to get more, as I said. I'm probably going to repeat myself a few times here. Nope, nothing there. Let's get these guys. And you'll notice that the mining beam is having a hard time getting overheated. That's why I installed the other upgrade. A lot of guys don't do that. I don't know why. It is so handy to not have to worry about overheating and you just keep going. Alright, oh, there's one right there. I don't know how much I have yet. I'm going to have to check real quick here. Let's get this last one. We have... How much carbon? 543. Should be enough. Do a quick scan. Our ship is right in front of us. And I want to find more dihydrogen. Let's go over this way. Gravitino balls. Because we're not starting near that other place, grab the Gravitino Balls and let them come after you, because guess what? You're constantly moving. You don't have time to sit there and chit-chat. Oh, that was carbon. 
Well, let them shoot a little bit too. Who cares at this point, you know? Because you're just moving, 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 moving. And they are going to lose track of you. And as you break these things up, you see your timer keeps resetting. They're about to start attacking me. But I don't care. One more scan. I really need condensed carbon. And some more oxygen over here. There we go. Got him. A little bit more oxygen would be nice. Okay. Reset. See? Not sure if I have condensed carbon around here or not. O2. I think we've got enough oxygen. Let me go and grab some more. I get some dioc dioxide at one of the space stations. Yeah, that's a shame right there, right? All this radiant shards here, and I can't collect a, a one of them. But one of these is a Atlantidium, I think. No, they aren't. They're all radiant shards. Unbelievable. I'd like to try to get the Atlantidium upgrade, uh, pardon me, um, achievement milestone right away. Words. Yes, I know. These two things down here are probably where Echo Seeds would be located. But this one on the right has rusted metal. Grab it for your other achievements. Or for the fact that you can get some stuff out of them. This one over here, right there. There it is. It's Lanthidium. We're going to go ahead and grab that. That one is as well. If I can get it. There we go. I don't think that's it. Okay, good. And it gives you bigger amounts of it rather than these little guys here. Okay, where's my ship at? Right there. There's some more, a more gravitino ball. Again, let them go ahead and come after you. There's our ship. Gravitino balls are worth quite a bit. We should be getting our achievement any time now. Oh, careful. I'm like backing down a slope. And I'm going to grab some more. There should be a few more. There's one over there. Again, we're at the 10 second mark, 10 minute mark here. Yeah, we're about to piss those guys off again. Just to give you a rough idea, they're worth 200,000 units in this small quantity. And if I can grab a few more, there's a couple over here. It looks like one at least. I like them in larger quantities. Uh, there's one over there on my right. Because I need about, I don't know, I'd like to have about 400,000 units. I'm really surprised I haven't gotten the Atlanta DM one yet. Hey guys, sorry. Yeah, there was one more up there, that's what it was. If you can gather it while they're still hunting you. All right, we should have enough now. How much do we have? 320,000. It's not a lot. Yeah, we should have the Atlanta DM. You've been already. Ah, achieved. Crap. All right, we do need... Let's just go in here real quick. A couple things we can get is this. All right. Great manipulator we hadn't put in there yet. We'll go ahead and do that real quick right now. And we'll create our items we need to repair our ship. Uh, let's see. We need that. We need that. We got to get... No, that's not what I want to be. Let's fuel you up real quick. We need more of this. 
We'll get more as we go. I need 30 right now. And we need ferrite. Where's our ferrite at? There we go. I need 50 of it. Come on. Again, not my best run, but I've gotten a certain achievements already. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put this in there and get that started as well. Uh, we're not going to do that yet. Let's go ahead and make our... Uh, we got the 50. Multi-tool, not multi-tool, starship. Repair. One. Two. And we're ready to go. There's the other achievement, finally. Come on. There we go. Now, the other thing we haven't gotten, as you probably already figured out, let me just get out a little ways, is we haven't gotten any of our crystal sulfide. We do need that. Uh, there's a good spot right down here. Let's go ahead and hit it. It's unfortunate. But we have to land. We have to get our crystal sulfide. We could find other places to get it from, but honestly, it's just a pain in the neck. So we'll get it while we're here. Again, this is extra time spent here, and this is the reason why my run always goes a little bit long. And remember I said I was going to scan the animals? I haven't scanned them yet. There's one. Two. Should be one more flying. There we go. And three. Let's go. Let's get in the water. Hopefully we have a crystal sulfide pretty close by. I'm not seeing any at the moment. Uh, getting some of those would be handy. Ask me what happened. A little something I learned from someone. There we go. Got all three of those. Now let's get the fish real quick. One. And there should be one more. I got the big guys. Where are they? Big flappy flappies. There you are. Two. And now we need crystal sulfides. Looking, looking, looking. There's some down there, right? Yes. A little further away than I want, but that's okay. Hopefully we have enough oxygen. I think we do. Alright, here we go. One, two... I just harvested oxygen. <laughs> I guess that works. There we go. There's our ship over there. Alright, we're done here. It's not bad. About 15 minutes or so. shallower. Should be able to get out. And then do that. And we're out of here. Alright. So we're done with this place, though. you notice our launch fuel is down to nothing. We're going to scan. And that'll get us our echolocation. On our way. We're going to jump in here. I'm going to leave you there. I'm going to put you over here, over here, over here. Put you over here. I'm going to drop you down one. Exosuit, real quick. We're going to get our jetpack. There we go. We're going to move you over one. We're going to move you over here. Put you up here. Put, drop you down here. We're going to open you real quick and pull our stuff out. All right. We're going to put you down here for selling. We're going to sell that. We're going to open that up. That's going to give our plasma launcher, which we're going to also uninstall and give us more stuff. We're gonna get rid of you. We're gonna put you in the ship. We're gonna put you in the ship. We're gonna keep you over here. Get rid of you up here, over in the ship. I'll hang on to you, you're handy. Don't wanna uh, do that real quick. This will, I will have an opportunity on the planet to get a couple things done. Because I know that between waves, I'm gonna have a couple extra moments. 
I always like to stop at this platform so I can get to the other ships easier. I know it gives me a cup, one last ship to get to, but honestly, I can't get to all the ships. And we already got a lander, and I have to get this stuff sold or else I'm not going to have any money to buy anything. Okay, sell. Come on. Living pearls we can get rid of. We'll get more later. Gravitino balls, 300,000. Tainted metal we'll get rid of. Anything else we can sell? Uh, I'm going to get rid of the unstable plasma. I don't need it anymore. All right, good. We're good. We should have enough cash to get some stuff. Let's see what we can get from this guy. Uh, Silver star bulbs, tritium. We'll grab the tritium. We'll grab... How much money do I have? I'll grab two starship launch fuels. We won't need it just yet. Oh, there's another guy over here. Wow, they're quick. Gamma root. We're already starting in a good shot spot right now. That's excellent. Let's see if this guy has... Uh, someone who has dioxide would be great. Where's the guy for this ship? He's already inside is what happened. Alright, so he'll be taking off. Once we're out of the way, see? Alright, so we have a moment. Let's go back through here. So we got the carbon. I'm going to put carbon over here. We're going to put you in the ship. Got a hundred... We never installed that, which means we didn't get that. We definitely need that installed right away. And if I can install it from here... See if we can do it from here. Yes, we can. I'm going to put you up there for now. All right, anything else? We're going to put the gamma root in there, put this in there, put that in there, and that in there. Yeah, why not? We'll put you in there, too. Uh, so we need more condensed carbon. We've got enough ferrite for now. Let's chop that in half. We'll get more later, but we do need more. Uh, oxygen, we got a good amount of. I'm very happy with that. The hydrogen, we're looking good at as well. Uh, we got another lander. I almost missed him. Where are you here? Ah, uh, two more. What do you got for me? Fesium. Okay, so that's the one we needed. We got that. We're done. Let's get this guy over here. He's going to have Fesium too, but we'll check him anyway. We got another guy over there. Uh, nope, he doesn't have what I'm looking for. Let's move on. Now, one might say, hey, you got everything you need. If I can get more gamma root, it just helps me out in the long run, because that always holds me up. Okay, good. And we got to achieve our... ...thing over here, so let's go ahead and do that. While we're here, we sold stuff, we didn't buy anything. Purchase, purchase, come on, let's go. I need one of these, I need one of those, I need one of these and two of these, I need both of you. And we're done here. Let's move on. Ships are taking off. Let's go back over here. We're going to need all of you and all of you. And anything else here? Anything else? Anything else? Anything else? Metal plates, right? Got them. I could use the pyrite as well, just in case. All right. Anything? Nothing. Let's go ahead and achieve this real fast. And we're done here. Oh, uh, nobody's landed, right? Down here? Nobody. Okay, good. <clears throat> Next wave is already coming in. Good shape. I get a drink. I'm losing my voice. Okay, and we're back, and it still didn't help any. Great. <clears throat> Let's see. Looked like the other wave was coming in. I don't see them, though. Oh, there's one down there. That's what happens when you get thirsty, huh? Uh, nothing. Thank you. I hate when that happens. The mouse registers that I've clicked off the screen someplace. I think we have somebody to the right, do we not? Yes, we do. It'd be great if you had some gamma root for me, man. Stop talking so much. He has gamma root. He only has 100. 
but that gets me up to almost 300 of it right now. So less that I have to gather later on. So if we can keep this going, we can go one more round, collect a reward while we're at it. We gotta build that real quick, so why don't we do that now? What do we need? We need something. An ion battery, which I do not have. For some reason. Uh, put you up here. Speaking of which, let me get rid of these. Uh, four plates is what we need for that. <clears throat> I know what to turn you into while we're here. Good. It looks like we got a ship coming in. And he's, of course he's down the other side. It always happens that way, doesn't it? <clears throat> Excuse me. Gamma root, see? See, very handy. And we still have enough to get by. How much do we have so far? We're already up to 450. If I can get one more person to land, give me about 150 of it. I'm all set. That's my ship. Stop. Almost did that. Uh, three more coming in right now. Let's see if we can wait that extra couple moments, because if, if they give us what we need, then we're in good shape. And it seems to be the Explorer class that are giving it, but I'll hit this guy up anyway. There he is. Nope. Sorry, buddy. Thank you. There's another one over here. I can just get one more. I did. Holy crap. We just got everything we needed. We don't have to stop for Gamma Root anywhere. We don't need the hazmat gauntlets. This is going to be a very good run if I can get in my ship. I don't know why it can't let you in the ship from that position for some reason. All right. And we are going to go ahead and build that thing in a second here. We do have to get an ion battery, and I can build one real quick. Uh, let me see here. Hold on. There we go. I don't know why we didn't get it as an achievement. Uh, collect the reward. Uh, I should really stop doing this, because what we need to do is go here. Okay, 23 minutes. It's actually, I mean, 24. It, it almost seems like we're not getting where we need to be. That it's like a really slow run. It's even worse if you forget to do things. Stop it. Hyperdrive. Oh, for crying out loud. There we go. Okay, good. Wasted a few seconds there. Remember, you're in this menu here. It doesn't give you any time off your clock here. So we're going to stop at the first space station. We're going to pick up a hyperdrive upgrade. And as we enter the station, we'll get whatever achievements we haven't gotten yet, the milestones, and see what kind of products we get out of it, and then see if we can get this going here. I really want to get this under an hour. If I can get it down to, like, you know, 58, 55 minutes, I'd be happy as a clam, honestly. Really wish I could have had a Sentinel ship, because then I wouldn't have to worry about these upgrades. I could just go, but it's taking the time to get the ship and the harmonic thing and everything like that. Do we have any other? No. Anything in here? Oh, let's put that over there. Okay, good. We need that. That's I'm in my starship. I don't know why I'm moving it over. I'm just make sure I don't have anything I can sell, which I don't. Let's just go ahead and do this. I forgot to get my achievement. Okay, so we don't waste time here. That's fine. Let's go to this system, which is what we were just at. This planet. Here we go. There we go. We got our nanites now. Okay. That didn't waste any time for us. We're going to go straight to him. Get him to stop talking. One down. Hyperdrive. Get back out. We want to install said hyperdrive. And now we've got an extra boosted amount. 
this is our exosuit, so let's put stuff over into there. Okay. Let's go. We could have done that while we were in transit, I know. There we go, and we want to do one more thing here. I wasting time right now. We need to hit the trade terminals. We've only got about 80,000 left, but it should be enough to get some of what I need here. Uh, we could always use a little bit more ferrite. We definitely need more cobalt, and that drops us down significantly. We don't need any of these. Can we get that? We can. And pure ferrite? Yes, we can. We're in good shape. Okay. The other terminal has something else, but if I'm not mistaken, yeah, we're, we don't have enough units to sell a thing. So, getting an extra pearl would have been great. It has something in there I could have used, but that's okay. We will get it. I promise. Alright. We need to go straight into hyperspace. And we are heading towards that. Right there. Now... After we're done with this world, we will land, we'll get back out of the system. The next system we're going to go to, we're going to stop at the space station there and get to pick up our last hyperdrive upgrade module. It's a really convoluted way of completing all these missions. There we go. Let them get lined up right. Yeah, we're not going to be lined up right. No big deal. Anything that we completed? Not yet. Is our first pilgrimage. What items do we have? Let's go ahead and get this installed. Where are you? There you are. Hmm. Let's put you over here. Uh, do we have enough to get rid of some of this stuff? Yes, we do. I need radiant shards to get rid of some of those. I don't want to get rid of that. No, we don't want to use that. Let's open up this one. And this one. We will get more Atlanta DM. Love to get an inverted mirror because this would be really, really handy. You know, if I put you there, that gives us this nice square right here. That'll work. Okay. Oh, see what I mean? How high are we? Oh, we're not far away. It's a little wonky. That's okay. Our base is over here that we need to camp ground. I need to go to is right over here. Should be down the slope on the other side of this. There it is. Boy, have you done this once or twice, Paul? Yeah, well, you know. How many times have they rested? I think Delta must have done it about 20 or 30 or 40 times by now. Maybe even more. Good grief. I think this is like my 8th or 10th time doing this one. For some reason, you got to reselect it for it to get the achievement. And you don't need to do anything else, really, but... One thing I always do at this campsite is I pick up all the ones around the outside. I don't bother with the one in the other corner over there. And get in my ship and take off. We'll check through what items we got later. You see my launch thruster recharged, so that was good. Uh, before we go there, we have to choose... Well, let's go ahead and grab it. Why not? Gives us a half a second. There we go. We've got to choose a second pilgrimage. So now we can go to hyperspace. And it should get us all the way there in one shot. Okay, so first things first, we're going to hit the space station. We've got a storage augmentation, so those are going to be worth some cash. So as soon as we start entering the space station, I'm going to see what kind of items I got from that campsite, the Pilgrimage 1. There we go. Uh, we're going to go ahead and install this, and then uninstall it. Exosuit, what do we got? Get rid of you, get rid of you. You're good. You can stay over here. You're going in the ship. What do we get out of that? That gave us something as well. Yeah, we don't need you either. Uh, let's put you over there. Oh, look at that. We have magnetized ferrite. That's handy. 
Uh, we need half of that turned into something. Get rid of this. Sorry, we gotta get these done real quick, or else we're gonna have trouble. Okay, and you. Install. We'll sell that. We don't really need it. And there's our two things that we needed. Go figure. Put you down here. Okay, Starship. Anything left? And I'm getting blown up with messages right now on my phone. <laughs> Unfortunately. Uh, just won't leave me alone long enough, I tell you. Yeah, stop waving. Thank you. I've got enough going on right now. Where's our hyperdrive? We're gonna go uh, install it. It always gets you into the wrong menu, I tell you. And we're at 600. Close enough. Okay, good. Let's get moving. We gotta hit the trade stations real quick. I don't need as much magnetized ferrite, but I could use the whole bundle if I can. Uh, we're gonna sell... Uh, we don't really need that anymore, or that. And we're going to get rid of... We'll keep the carbon nanotube for now. Where'd it go? There we go. Multi-tool, exosuit, and storage. There we go. That gets us plenty, right? Uh, go up one. we got magnetized ferrite. And that should give us all that we need completely. Uh, anything else? Let's get more ferrite and more cobalt, of course. Get out of here. And I think the other terminal has one other item I could use. No ships at the moment. Took too much time. 33 minutes, what we're at right now. Probably close to like 25. Let me just see here. Salt. We didn't even need salt, and I can't remember what it was for, but here we are. Yeah, we'll get the pure fire right. We don't really need it, but we'll get more. Alright, we should be good to go. Let's get to our pilgrimage. And we are really not going to hit many space stations after this. This is pretty much it for us as far as space stations are concerned. Because we should have everything we need. We have a nearly 600 um, distance we can go on these. Let's get you recharged up. Let's put you down here. Cobalt can go over there. I don't know why it happened over here. Probably because I had it selected last. We're in pretty good shape. we got enough Atlantidium, I think. What do we got go over here? Yeah, why not? Um, what do you got? Uh, nothing I can use. Thank you. So, not really worth the time. Anything else in my inventory? We can put you over there, put you over there. What do we get out of you? Some ionized cobalt. Now that we have more cobalt, probably going to bounce off the atmosphere here. Okay, so this one is Pilgrimage 2. It should be over here. This lower sloped mountain right in the middle of all the big ones. And it should be on the lower slope right there. There it is. Well, thank heavens I was already here. Because those storms are terrible, especially on Planet 4. The fourth Pilgrimage, you cannot see a thing. I don't need anything from here. Except the achievements. And this. I don't have to get anything from the buckets anymore. I'm done. Okay. Oh, wait. Yeah, that's where I wanted to be. And it is 2713. Yep, somebody figured that out. Speeds it up just a touch. Finalize. Done. Let's get going. I can get out of this and get into my ship. Thank you. And we're taking off right away. Launch thrusters kept charged. That's pretty good. We'll charge for the next one, too. Okay, we need to go in here and choose Pilgrimage 3. And then we can go to hyperspace. And we should have enough to get all the way there. Yes, we do. See? See? Now, fortunately, with these two upgrades, for some reason, I avoid space battles, and I don't know why. I get one pirate hit uh, on the approach to the fifth pilgrimage, I think. And it's a singular pirate. Take him out within 30 seconds, and you're on your way. So, 
We'll see how that goes. So I keep the main time down to about an hour and 15. Hour and 20 tops. I think I should be able to get this below an hour. Over this way. It almost always is. To the right. Rendezvous 3. It's going to be negative 15 and 67. Nope. Go here. Collect. There we go. Collect. Yep, I know I've got the new formula. Alright, we don't have anything else to collect. Let's make sure this is still selected. We'll have to probably reselect it again. Anything on our ship? Put you installed here. Looks like we have to have, actually have this selected for once. Alright, so again, negative 15 and then positive 67. Oh, well, it's close enough. Coming in a steeper angle, which is actually pretty good. Whoa, okay, stop that. About making myself sick. Alright, it already moved, and I want to say it's to the left. Could be wrong. And we can get another achievement here while we're here. 67. I think it's straight ahead. Right over here? There it is. Okay, good deal. Okay, one of the other achievements we need is Radiant Shards. Do we have anything on our ship that we need to do anything with? I'm going to put that in my other inventory just to get it out of the way. Okay, get out of here. And you see I've got condensed carbon in the distance. Yep, we're going to have to choose it anyway. Thank you, I know. And I'm going to take a moment in a second. 2813. Hold on a second here. 8 and 13. If I can get my cursor there, I can just click on it and be done. There we go. Alright, there we go. There we go. Now, yeah, this is the place to get Radiant Shards. And I, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to take a boost someplace else. And I'm going to make more of those in a little bit here. Because I want to... Find better Radiant Shard positionings here. Groupings like right here would be good. Looks like I got a couple friends over there in the corner. Come on, drop down, drop down, drop down, drop down. Boy, this thing takes forever to land. Anybody ever notice that? Got two radiant shards. There we go, get our condensed carbons. Ah, that'll actually be really handy. That's all Atlantidium. There's a Radiant Shard there. That's three. I need more. There's a bunch up there. Uh, let's see, and I had no... Oh, let's get the dihydrogen while we're here. That's excellent. That should keep us clear. Excellent, excellent. We don't need to worry about that. I'm going to stay away from those guys, even though it will help upgrade my ship. Let's go over here. Good that we're getting hit by the storm right now. This will give us, it looks like, a couple more. Okay. We never got our dock site, so... Let's see, we got some radiant shards over there. Let's head over that way. There's another system you can go to that you can get more at, but... There's some over there. I'm down. Let's get up to the rise and get a nice proper jump boost. There's one there. Should be able to hit it in just a second. There we go. Let's 
Sorry, buddy. Get your butt out of the way. Stop standing there. There's another one. Another one. Another one. Nope, that wasn't another one. That's a DM. That's a DM. We'll go ahead and grab them anyway. We're here. How many are we up to? Let's check real quick, shall we? We need... Four more. Let's go. Oh, we gotta look. I forgot to look. There's some over here. It'd be great if we could find a cluster of them. I hope the storm lasts just a little bit longer, because it's very convenient. Uh, how many do we have? At least three. No, maybe two. Yeah, just a two. I think there's one... Nope, there's not one there. We need one more cluster. Uh, looks like we have some over there. Need two more. Looks like it's only one, but I'll take whatever I can get. Oh, there's that cluster over there. I don't think we have enough condensed carbon, don't you? And we should be able to get it now. There you go. And my ship is over here. Okay. I thought I could get a thrust out of that. That's all right. There we go. And... I think we're pretty much done with this area. That's good. And before we go any further, we're on to our... See, we did third pilgrimage. We got everything there. Okay, we got to the fourth pilgrimage. Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> so if things go well, we will only need that one other... Um, right. Sorry, I'm stupid. We'll only need that one other launch thrust fuel. Launch fuel. Mm. We may have to make one more. But so far, so good. Okay. Should be... Let me guess. It's the other way? Nope, nope, nope. I was going the right way. Okay. Now, I think... Is this one that I get the... I think this one is where I get the attack. We'll see. Alright, I, we need to collect. So, starting here, we'll collect that. We don't really need to install anything else, really, at this point. So, I think we're ready to go. We need to create those things that are bored. This one will be handy. I'm going to go ahead and install it anyway. Uh, what's this? Yeah, that's an auto charger for our launch. Yes, let's do that. Yeah, I'll go ahead and put this in. Why not? Nothing else in there, right? There's no room in my starship. Great. Yeah. We're almost where we need to be, and I'm running out of spots. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of these. I don't really need them, and I need the space. Yeah, we know. Alright, so this is Camp 4. Positive 9, negative 39. Oh, gosh, darn it all. If I can get... No, nope, it's not going to work. And this is the gamma root one, which is hilarious, because we're not actually going to need the gamma root. Ah, this is the one that comes down the slope a little way, so I think we're approaching it from the wrong direction, and it might be down here. Ha, ha, ha! Guessed right. <laughs> there we 
go. Anything else we can do here? Let's get back to my exosuit. Okay, good. Dense. We've got ionized cobalt. We're going to need that. We will probably need more as we go. Let me get that going. Okay, out we go. Will it give it to us? No, I'm going to have to select it again. There we go. Let's get this. And this one is 4, 10, 15. So 4, 10, 15. Extreme hazard planet. Dump. Get our cursor down there. Never finalize. Okay, good. And we still have yet to build all those things, isn't it weird? We still haven't done it yet. That's going to be next. Okay, so we're done here. We don't have to do any gamma root. Isn't that brilliant? Okay, let's get in here. Let's get to our next phase. Oh, yeah, I'm hitting the wrong buttons all over the place here. I'm getting so excited by that. Okay, we're going to go here. Okay, so this is phase five. We've got a lot of achievements to accomplish. We've got to get all those construction uh, constructs built. Now, we may have to take a moment here, <clears throat> even though we're going to be landing. We save time doing other stuff. Okay. Now this one, if you don't go off to this to the side a little bit, you will run into a squadron, a ship squadron that shows up and blocks you. If I can get this lined up right. There we go. Alright, we're going to collect our reward here. And I don't think we have anything else to do here. So we're going to stick on this one. We're going to go in here and start building stuff. Alright, so first things first. Let's go ahead and build that. We already have the ability to do it. We can make him. We get more carbon nanotubes. So let's go ahead and get one, two. Let's build you. And we need to build that, right? No, we already built that, so that's someplace in here. Uh, the lubricant. we got to build the lubricant. One, two. Now we can build you. Alright, that's three. And four is somewhere in our inventory. See? There it is. Let's get out of the atmosphere for a moment. Where'd he go? He is over there. Yeah, did you get off the screen already? Good grief. He's gone. Okay, where's our... I need to get to our pilgrimage. Gotta show back up again. Now this one's always a tough one to find for me. I don't know why, but I can never find this one on my own. It's at neg positive 10, positive 17, or just in that general area. So, let's see if I can find it this time. I'm approaching it from a kind of a strange direction, so let's go ahead and come in a little bit early. Alright, let's see. Positive 10, positive 17. Looks like we're headed in the right direction. Nope, we're not. Nope, not going this way. This way? Yeah, this is the direction. So it should be over in this general direction. Let's uh, get out of first person. Or third person. First person? That was first person. Never mind. And take see if we can take a look around, see if we can find it in the distance here. I mean, you got these bases all over the place. I don't know if that's it or not. Oh my gosh, it is. Well, look at that. I'll be darned. Okay, this is great. All right. Let's go ahead and select it again because it's not registering. There we are. Get in here. This one is 51116. Uh, 11. 16. That should be the last one. I'm going to go ahead and do it while we're here because I will end up forgetting at some point. Let me just check something real quick because I think it's over here someplace. There it is. 
All right, let's get you down here where we need you. And we're going to pick the final one, which we have everything for. Excellent. Okay, we're in good shape. Let is Let us get out of here. If I can get in my ship again. There we go. All right, so we've got Pilgrimage 5 done. It says to go on the Atlas interface, but we're not going to do that. we got to do this. So we got rewards we're going to collect here in just a minute. We're not going to do it right now. Um, we will eliminate them later. We have to do Nada's lead. But before we can do it, we're going to pull in the anomaly right now, but we're going to use it to transport ourselves to our first space station. Because if everything goes right, which it didn't on my last run that I did on my own, it should get us into a system close by to the Atlas station that will also have a dissonant world in it that has no gravity. Or extremely low gravity. It's a lifeless planet, so it makes it real easy to take on Sentinels there. Because you can float the whole time. Alright, so we're not going to Nada like it's telling us to do. We're going to go all the way up here. We're going to hit the portal and jump back. Now, I could have gotten some of my achievements while I was coming to this station, uh, the milestones, but I forgot about that. Uh, it is what it is. Okay. We've got really good time going on. This is the best time I've had in a while. Uh, space stations, and we're going to hit this one, which is the first one we were at and the last one on the list. And we're not going to do anything in the space station. We're not going to sell anything. We're not going to get rid of anything. Honestly, what we should do is go through our inventory and delete stuff. <clears throat> Pardon me. It would be easier. Okay. <clears throat> as soon as I can run. There we go. Yep, we know. We know. Let's get in here. We're going to pull in the anomaly one more time. Solar sails barely open by the time you get into the anomaly and they start closing again. Alright, so what are we doing here? Um, if you can get it quick enough, you can start getting all your rewards before it starts to do stuff. There we go. Get you. Get you. There we go. Is there anything else? Okay, so that should be all of them. Okay, we won't get these yet. We'll get those in a few minutes. Let me just make sure. Okay, we're in good shape. We just need to do this. And it's going to put us at the furthest one again. Every now and then you get fortunate. They start putting you at the closer ones, but it is what it is. This isn't terrible. So at the 55 minute mark, usually I'm hitting Nada after the one hour mark. So this is pretty good. Go, 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 go. Okay. And all we need to do is leave again. And it says mission targets into the system. System should be very close by. And as you can see, my I'm not using my Starship's launch abilities. So it should be recharging. There we go. Just a little bit of a ways away before we can pull in our galaxy map. Okay, and you see it's really close. We're going to go ahead and head there right now. It's a dissonant system as well, obviously. But we're not going to be doing any of the fighting until we go through the atmosphere. That line. I keep talking about that. I don't know. I don't know which way it goes. Okay. And it should be really close by. There it is. <clears throat> Excuse me. I don't know what is up with my voice except for that weather. I don't know. I promise I'm not getting sick. And I'm pretty sure it's not contagious through a video. Well, God forbid, right? Alright, and it should be right over here. There it is. Yep. Last time I overshot it like crazy because I forgot to slow down. Oh, 
Okay, here we go. We obviously have everything we need to fill this in. Okay. You gotta be standing before it will let you select it. <clears throat> you can't be in the air. Just keep going, keep going, keep going. And we're done. There we go. And we're out of here. Someone pulling the anomaly again. <clears throat> we'll go ahead and get our divergence reward for this expedition. <clears throat> Excuse me. We want to check our inventory real quick because so it might be getting full. Yeah, I was right. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of these things. We really don't need them anymore. I don't need that, that's for sure. Don't need that anymore, and we don't need that anymore. Okay, we've got plenty of inventory space now. Now we need to select... Where are you? Complete the schematic is what we need. So, this will... It landed us in the same spot? Yeah, it did. What do you know? Alright, so this time we're going to hit Nada up one more time. He'll direct us to Polo. Polo will start our 11 minute countdown. And then we'll hit the Atlases. There we go, Polo. Hi, Polo. I have something for you. Okay. We're done. Before we go, so this is on an 11 minute timer right now. We are going to go over here and hit our Atlas. And this is the key to it, and Jason didn't know about this when he was doing his speed runs. The guy was getting 51 minutes, 52 minutes, and he didn't even know you could do this, and that is to complete all the Atlas runs um, in one shot at one Atlas station. So I have a funny feeling Jason's going to be doing it like 30 minutes now. Eh, he'll probably save like about 4 or 5 minutes, but still, he'll, he'll end up, he will end up with the fastest time at this point. Okay, we don't need that yet. We just need to do that. Alright, so where are we going? And our Atlas station is up here. It's taking us pretty far, so I have a funny feeling this is going to be our... It is a dissonant system, though, it says. But it says it's at a jump range. That's crazy. It shouldn't be. So we're going to have to take two jumps. That's interesting. That's okay. We'll take two jumps. Because they're literally instantaneous. It'll only spend an extra few seconds. But it just means that the planet I'm going to land on for fighting the Sentinels is going to be a little bit tougher. Probably. But that's okay. You know, we'll deal with it. Just got to remember to get 19 of them next. next. My last run I hit 17 and I thought I was done. There we go. A few seconds, right? And there it is. On our way. Here we go. Not bad. We're under an hour. Unbelievable. This is going to be my fastest run. I'll definitely be under an hour for the entire run at this point. Because there's no reason why I can't complete everything. I'm cringing a little bit. Like, I know I, the other shoe's going to fall or something like that. And I'm going to discover that I've forgotten something vital. But we'll find out. But so far, this is, I think, my best run ever. I might even just drop the mic after this one and call it a day. Alright, anything in here I need to achieve? No, nope, we've got everything. How's our inventory look? We're looking okay. I think we've got everything. Launch thrusters need help. I'm gonna keep you. Let's get our launch thrusters up to snuff, because we're gonna need those. No, we're good there. We're good there. How's our exosuit look? We need... I'll take one of you. There we go. Okay, so now we're all set. We shouldn't have anything to worry about. We do need to get these achievements, because one of them gives us our neutron cannon. I saw Delta-1 do it with a bolt caster. I don't have any idea how the heck he got it accomplished. And still got his fast times, but there you are. So, see? This is the first one, right? And you tab your way through. You can go right back in and go for the second one. Jason didn't know this. He knows it now. And you know he's got the fastest time at this point. Tab. Reselect. 
and I'm going there as quick as I can, as soon as it will allow me to do so. All the crappy noises from it. That's why I lowered the volume on the game, so you probably can't hear as much. Here we go, last one. And... That's it. Final. We're done. So we've gotten all five atlases done. This is going to complete out a few, more than a few, of our... Expeditions. So what we want to do here is we've got to make the seeds, right? One, two, hopefully I have everything. Three, four, and five. We got all of our seeds. And now we can collect our rewards. Let's let it get all the achievements. So where's our dissonant world at? We need to find it. That's not it. How about you? That's not it. Where's the world at? Is this one? Nope. Little guy? Nope. Ah, uh, where is it? I gotta find the dissident planet. It might be up here. Is that it? Nope. How about this one? Found it. We're on our way. Okay, let's get our rewards real quick. get them to stop doing that. I can get all the achievements. <laughs> there we go. Got everybody. Get off my screen. Uh, okay, did we get everything? We got everything. Okay. So what we need, let's go back over here. We're going to complete the schematic. And then we'll get everything in here in one shot. And that will complete out all these. And we need to do eliminating. So we have to do one more thing as we come in very slowly to the planet. We have to install you. Get you up here. No, it's in the starship find it. There we go. One. One. And where are you? There you are. Neutron cannon. We're going to install that. 11,000. I don't think there's any better arrangement. Yeah. Give me 11,000. Can I get any of these out of my way? I can get that out of my way. Yeah, that'll work. We just got it. Okay, that'll get me up to less. Okay, well, we'll keep it. Let's get down here. Now, this is not an ideal planet to be doing this on, but any planet will work. I'm gonna land sideways. Eh, whatever. I just want to check something real quick because my exosuit is gonna get real full real fast. Don't actually eliminate the wrong things. Okay, let's get out of here. All right, we want to take a look around, and we don't I don't see any activity from any of these guys, so I'm going to go for a Gravitino Ball. Uh, let's see what we're on. Neutron Cannon, all set. Let's go. That's not what you should be doing. Okay, where are you? There we go. So, here we go. One. Two. There's the rest. Okay, so we're multiplying. That's fine. Okay. Any time now. Where are they? They're over... Here. Here we go. Okay. Three. Four. And 
and 5. So we got it selected, right? Yes. Okay. Just making sure. So we should be able to complete all this. And we should be getting close to the time when... Oh, uh, here we go. You want to keep moving, because invariably there'll be somebody else here. Here we go. Then. Anybody else? Take a look around. No. I want to get up the slope a little bit. Yeah, I'm collecting. Hi, guys. Two, three, come on, four, where's the other little guy, five, where's the big guy, six, should be another one that just popped up, got him, oh, detected, by what, who, where, where are they? Oh, gosh, I'm looking right at him. Okay, that's... I need one more. And then we're done. Where's my ship at? I'm always doing that, right? Doesn't really make a difference. I'm going to have to run around, but if I can get my ship right away... Got him. Okay, that should be it. So where is my ship? There it is. Okay. We're going to head straight for the ship. So I found something out. I could wait the full minute, right? 50 seconds or whatever. But why? Why? Why indeed? You don't have to go far. Ah, there, can not pull, pull it in, that's okay. So, you got these guys approaching a combat range, but that's okay. You just need to get into your, into your anomaly. Now, they are going to attack you at some point. There you are, see? They don't do enough damage to even really worry about them. You're going to slow down real mu a lot when you get here. But as soon as they pass by, it pulls you in, and you're done. Let's get our achievements. Uh, phase three is complete. Now to be clear, I can get out of here. One's complete, two's complete, three's complete, four we're almost done with, and five is going to be completed here momentarily. So hopefully we can get this done here because we're at an hour ten. I am literally about fifteen minutes quicker than I have been. Getting kind of excited here, and not the best landing spot, but I'm going to have to leave and come back. So. The next landing spot is going to be the crucial one. Holo just completed it, so I'm in pretty good shape as far as my time-wise is concerned. There we go. Okay. Oh, right. Okay. Sorry. That was the... What am I doing? Brain fart. Just gotta go over here and greet it. Looks like we got plenty of run juice, so that's good. That's a good thing to keep an eye on, because of all the running you're gonna have to do after this. Keep, 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 keep. Put it in. There it is. He gets lost. One more achievement. Now we get this. Get rid of that. <clears throat> okay. Here we go. You have to build the attachment for your multi tool. You don't have a choice. That is part of the achievement for the milestone. Okay, over to Polo, who gives us the part we need. One hour and 11 minutes. We can now put it in. So we'll just put it over here. Got everything we need. Excellent. So that's all we need. Now, if we're fortunate enough, we are going to get Echo Seeds. And there's two ways to do it. 
either landing on the planet and finding one, or getting one of those un units to pop up in the uh, pulse drive. Which we'll try that first, because that is obviously faster. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We'll get one here. There's one. And one more time. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We got it again. And we got another one. So we got our Echo Seeds. Um, I can't seem to get out of that. Thank you. We're going to pull in the Anomaly. And we are literally done. We are in record, record time. I am definitely under an hour. I'll tell you that right now. I don't know if I'm going to have any, you know, record-breaking times here, but I don't think we'll beat anybody else. But this is incredible. Now it's just the parking space is going to be very important here. But we'll take the way that we get, you know. All the way over, all the way, all the way. Ah, okay. Well, that'll work. That'll work. It's the furthest one. It's one of the furthest ones, but it's right outside this window, so I can't be too, too upset. I just have to hit Nada. So we'll finish this in the next, I think, minute. By a minute, an hour 14, I think we'll have this done. Ugh. Sorry about the noise in the background. Kids don't know how to turn doorknobs. One. Two. Three. And that is it. We've completed all of the achievements. The milestones, they're all done. We just need to talk to the con to the construct construct over here, and we should be finished. My fastest time yet, I guarantee it. And we're just going to choose whatever the first ones are. We have one more thing to do. There we go. And communication, and we're done. Okay, in, out, stop the timer, to be certain, completed, complete, complete, this one is complete, we're not going to get the rewards, I don't care, if I complete, you see all of them completed, okay, let's get out of this and see what we got, oh man, I'm really excited about this one. Okay, so an hour and 14 minutes is what our timer shows, is that really what we've got here. Uh, I'm thinking about 20 minutes off, so I'm probably thinking about 54 or 53, so probably somewhere in that range. Let's see what we got here. I know, suspense, right? 55. I'll take it. 55 minutes. <laughs> wow, 19 minutes faster. Uh, than the time on the screen and eight minutes faster than my best time so far. And I wasn't even at the best spot to start at. If I was at the best spot to start at, I probably could have shaved off a few extra minutes. Probably got this down to about 52, maybe 53, which would have been even better. But 55, I am very, very happy with. Um, wow. So we're going to get rid of this one because obviously we don't need that one anymore. Yay. And it's gone. All right, and that concludes this run. I hope you all enjoyed it. Um, please hit the like and subscribe. Uh, I think this is an incredible achievement. I, I mean, even Jason only did it in an hour on his first run, so I'm really happy with this. So, you know, I don't know. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Please throw some comments in there. Tell me what you think. Uh, and we will see you folks in the next episode whenever I can get to it. i got a lot going on this week. Um, my daughter's moving in by Friday, and I've got a wall to build downstairs and a door to put in and all kinds of other stuff. i got a lot of construction going on the next three days. So hopefully I can get some stuff done here. Thank you again for watching. Take care, everybody. 
And of course, I like to always say this, and I keep forgetting to say at the end of my videos, never criticize kindness and always be kind when you can. And as always, I always tell people, be truthful in everything you do, especially to yourself, because that's where it starts. Thank you very much for watching. Take care, everybody.